Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am so excited to be sharing a closet and office tour with all of you. I know I've shared my closet and office tours in the past, but I've updated this room a little bit as you can see from the background. I'm gonna be giving a tour of my office space, my closet space, and I'll have everything that I mentioned linked below. I'm gonna try to link everything that I can. A lot of this stuff is actually newer, so you should be able to check it out online. I have a lot to share with you guys, but really quickly before we get started, if you are new here, welcome. My name is Karen and I make fashion, beauty, and lifestyle videos here on my channel so i would love it if you would join us and hit that subscribe button i make videos three times a week as i said on fashion try on hauls wardrobe favorites jewelry favorites beauty home decor a mix of everything on this channel and give this video a like if you're excited and you love like tour videos all right we are gonna get started because i'm so excited to share this space with all of you so let's get started so when you're at my closet and office door when you walk in over to the right is this section which most of you guys will recognize so i'll go in depth on everything for sure but i just wanted to give you guys a little overview of the room this is where i do all my work there's my try on mirror over here it's a little bit like not as organized or aesthetically pleasing, but it's more just for practical purposes. I'll get to all that in a minute. And then if I'm standing at the door to the room again on the left is this new section right here. So I guess we'll just start in this new section here because I love how this all turned out. It all came together in the end really well. Um, so we'll start off. I have this like little room divider because behind on the wall, there's like all um, electrical stuff so I just hit it with this screen so I got this lucite and gold shelf and I absolutely love it like so so much just got it in and I adore it and I'm so glad I went with it because I just feel like it's very unique and we'll start off with this top shelf so on here I have three coffee table books I have this Paris book this new Dior book and the like to know it book that I got when I went to fashion week they gave these out the like to know it party so um, I have these three books here along with one of my bags and then moving down to the second shelf is my little hairband section um, with a few decorative accents so as you guys know if you've been on my channel I love these Lily headbands and the like the lookalikes um, or any kind of hairband in general. So I will try to link everything below that I'm showing you guys in case you want to check it out. All the hairbands are either the actual Lily Sadoe brand or a dupe from Amazon. So I will link them. And then I have my gospel according to Coco Chanel underneath that and this gold little tray, which I believe is from Target but I'll see if it's still available because I got it a while ago. I have this Nest candle. This is actually the holiday candle and I love the way it smells, but it's still so pretty even for all year round. And then I have this frame that says she believed she could, so she did. Just love the inspiration behind it. And then moving along to the third shelf is this really pretty floral vase. It has like the fake water at the bottom. It looks pretty real actually. I really love the quality of this. I mean, it looks absolutely stunning. So I love that on here with the marble little tray. And then one of these blush pink office like storage boxes. And then bottom shelf, I just kept it very simple because every shelf kind of had a lot going on. So I decided with this bottom shelf just to have a you know pair of shoes. And these are so comfy. I highly recommend if you're looking to splurge on them, definitely worth the splurge. Now this rug I've had actually for quite some time. So when I lived at my parents, I had this in my bedroom there. And then when I moved, um, I did not take it with me. So I decided to take it back. Um, so yeah, I brought it here and I just think it pulls the whole look together. And then I got in this rack, which I've shared with you guys before. I love the way it looks. It's a dupe for a rack that I've seen like they usually go for like $500, but this was really inexpensive. So um, yeah, I feel like it's very sturdy. I put this garland on it myself. And it's just like pink floral. And then I just placed some of my favorite dresses on this rack and a kimono on the end. So um, we'll go actually over these pieces because I love them so much. So this is one of my Love Shack fancy dresses. This was actually, I think, one of the first ones I got. Yeah, I got this last year when I went on a trip to St. Pete Beach. We stopped at the mall in Tampa and I picked this out. I actually had um, a campaign for a Taylor Swift's Lover album and I was promoting the album and they said if I want to wear like a Lover inspired outfit and I just came up with this. I thought the pink and the roses and it was just like so girly and feminine for Lover inspired vibes. So I love it so much. Second dress is this one here. It's like this white one. This is also Love Shack Fancy. It's just a really nice like white staple dress 
you're looking for like one Love Shack Fancy dress to splurge on, I recommend this one. And then I have a Love Shack Fancy nightgown or like little, yeah, like I guess it's like a nightgown. This is from ASOS. It is a gingham cover up. It's really inexpensive. This is my loft dress in white. Um, this is a Love Shack Fancy dupe. So it's like really inexpensive. And then this kimono. So this is great for just like over a tank top or or the beach. So as I said, I'll link it all up for you guys in case you're interested. At the bottom, I have a vase of flowers. You're gonna see a few vases of flowers in my office. I got them from Grace Rose Farm. They're amazing. They ship anywhere. This is not sponsored, but um, if you're interested, I'll link them below because you could order them for any occasion. And I just love the quality. I mean, it's incredible. Moving over here. Okay, there might be a little glare on here. So I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see the whole look of it, but I got this gallery wall. I originally got it for my living room, but I thought this worked way better here. So I got the white frames and then these prints from an Etsy shop and I really love like the Parisian vibe to it. I'll just kind of go in close so you guys can see. There's the Eiffel Tower and then just some flowers and whatnot. So I really love how it turned out. And then I got this like little table flowers. I wish you guys could smell these because they smell so amazing. And then I just got this jewelry box in I love this for storing some of my jewelry. I have quite a bit and I was actually looking for some storage and I thought this would be perfect. It's a lucite and gold again, so I thought it actually went perfect with my shelving. But when you lift up the top, you could see everything that you have really well. Um, it's, I love how like the organization is on it and then you could pull out, we'll actually pull out the bottom one because it'll be easier. This is my bottom one. Just a look, little look at the jewelry. I have a lot of jewelry videos on like some of my favorites. A lot of it's Kendra Scott, Miranda Fry, Gorgiana, I think that's how you pronounce it, and some Target even. So there's a little look. Some of the jewelry pieces I have on right now, so that's why it's a little empty. But yeah, there's a little overview of my jewelry. And then I just got this table from Target, so it was really inexpensive. So that's pretty much this whole side of the room. I'm gonna back up so you guys could see, but I love it so much. I mean, I just adore it. So definitely excited about this new section. All right, we're gonna move on to this side of the room. As I said, you have this right side of the room. So let's go over my closet system. So this is, of course, this is not all of my clothing. I actually have quite a bit of storage in my apartment, like a lot of closet space, I should say. Big walk-in closet in my bedroom where I store a lot of my clothes and a lot of different things. Um, there's also a walk-in closet right here. It's pretty, it's actually bigger than my bedroom closet and I do have a lot of storage of clothing in there, but it's very messy. So we won't go on that today, but I will show you guys, this is like the basis of all my shoes are pretty much here. I do have some snow, like wintry boots back here cause I can't fit them all. So there are other pairs of shoes that I just can't fit them all. But most of the main ones that I use most of the time are out here. So we will start on the right. I believe this is a 19 inch. This is a 39 inch, 29 inch and a 39 inch right here. So I have four units from Ikea, it's the Ikea packs wardrobe system. You could completely customize it down to every single shelf and drawer, whether you want it a glass shelf or a white like wooden shelf. So there's just so much customization with it, which is why I really like it. I get a lot of questions on whether I recommend it or not. I mean, is it gonna be the best quality closet system you've ever owned? No, but like it's still really, really good price point compared to some of the custom closets. At the top, I just have some bags and boxes and then up here I just have one of my bags and this shelf I love this bag so much I mean it is definitely a really good one like one of my favorites actually and I have a pair of heels and then I have this bag another one of my favorites I don't know if I could ever like sell this bag we'll see but I just really really love it um it's just like me in a handbag and then below here is one of my neverfuls that I get a lot of use out of. And then I actually have these three books. I collect them from Georgiana Lane. She's an amazing photographer. She travels and she has a London book, a Paris and New York. And then I just have my hunter boots below and then some snow boots all the way in the back because it is summertime when I'm filming this, depending on when you're watching this. So the second system from the right is here and I just have some dust bags and whatnot up here. This, I get questions on people like, is this my clothes you own? No, this is just like clothes that I love and like they all aesthetically go together. I just love the way it looks. Um, I like to color coordinate things, so I really like this. So yeah, love how this all came together and it looks kind of like a boutique and I like the white wooden hangers, so it all looks very uniform. 
Otherwise, I just have velvet hangers in the rest of my closet. And then over here, I just have this Swan. I believe I got this at Anthropology. And then a Dior book and a Lauren Conrad book. And moving on to this drawer, which is so fun, I feel like. And it's just filled with a lot of really fun accessories. Um, I got these jewelry divider trays from Amazon. I will link them. I have four total. Now, of course, I'm not going to go through every single bracelet. But over here, just like my Victoria Emerson wrap bracelets. They go all the way back there. Um, some bangles and some other bracelets that I just have. And then I have... Um, some earrings. These are mostly all like statement earrings here. And then behind here, I just have some like jewelry boxes and some little coin pouches. And then on the side here, I have some more coin pouches that I've shared in other videos. Some more bracelets there because they don't all fit. So yeah, that is that jewelry drawer. Then in here is some handbags. I like to be able to like just see everything. So I like how this is all laid out and you could see all the bags. So here's a little look these are like chanel flat bag dupes and yeah these bags here some more designer dupes this is like another designer dupe this is a dior bag dupe and yeah this is like a forever 21 this is top shop this one's a lily pulitzer this is express i have some more bags too in that walk-in closet i talked about and then this drawer I just cleaned out actually and I'm really trying to, I donate a lot of my clothes. Um, so I try to every season really just like clean it out. So this is some of my sweaters and I have more sweaters in this drawer. And now moving along to this section right here. Okay, up here is a Louis Vuitton bag and then right here are some of my other bag favorites. I mean, they're all like my favorite because of course I wouldn't keep them if they weren't. So here's a few more bags. This is a really great summer one. I love it so much. And then moving along to this section here. I love this like little section here. It's kind of like the like center of it all. Like I just love it so much with like the peonies. I just put like on this ribbon that I had from like a handbag packaging. And then right here I have my YouTube plaque from reaching 100K. So of course it's like really meaningful to me. So I just have that there and then you can see me filming and moving along i have some necklaces and rings back here i just cleaned that out because i got that jewelry box over there and then this is like a ton of necklaces they're all like on these like hooks which keeps them really nice and organized and separated and then this i have this like little marble tray it has just some of my favorite things on it or things that like um i use on the daily i use this watch quite a bit so i have that out there and my earrings and i like these hair clips so um yeah and then my other bag in here i have a lot of belts and sunglasses so a lot of accessories and some of my watches so there's all the belts it's like was from like holiday time i got this and then sunnies been building up the collection this is more just like fun sunglasses this is more like everyday sunglasses and let's see Okay, and then these shoes, I recently kind of switched them out. So I did more like my summery everyday sandals in here. Let's go in close because there's like a double row back here. You probably may recognize a lot of these sandals from my like try and hauls. Here's the second row. And then the third row, you can see all the way back there. Okay, moving along to this last section of the IKEA wardrobe system. So this um, starts with a lot of like my fall boots up top here more transitioning into fall time again more like short booties let me take these off so you guys can kind of see but back here i have more booties if you could see these are like one of my favorite shoes to wear for fall and then moving along these are just like my sandals like with the block heels on them or like a skinnier heel these are really good for like a formal occasion they're really comfy these are like the these are the dupe to the Stuart Weitzman ones, which I have here. I've worn these to so many events, like so many memories in these shoes and actually these shoes back here too. And yeah, I have a pair of wedges back there. And then this shelf here, some more summer shoes. Had to double up on some of them back here. And, and I just like stacked them on top of each other. Who remembers these shoes back here? I just love these so much. I know so many of you got them. So you have to let me know if you remember them. I have the other pair here too. I love them so much. I actually need to bring those out and wear them. So then here's some more flat sandals, 
some sneakers. I have my other athletic sneakers. I just don't have them all right here. They're in my um, foyer closet. Some more shoes back there. Then this is like a little pull out um, thing with the system. You could like customize this. I have a bunch of jeans on here and I have another bin of jeans in my other closet. Some over the knee boots back there stacked up. And then here I customize it to have like the glass in the front so you could see like the cute pouches. So I changed this drawer to like more of like my travel pouches, like makeup bags in case I wanna, I mean, I'm not traveling this second. If I do need anything, I have it here. So I have this pouch and then this one, this was like limited edition. So I grabbed this one too. Ooh, this one's like from Lauren Conrad. And back there we have a few more. This is a dupe. And then this is like, I think Pottery Barn. So that's in that drawer. And then in here is just all my denim shorts. You can see all these. A lot of these are my favorite A Goldie shorts. And let's see, Express, some more A Goldie. And then, yeah, another pair of A Goldie. <laughs> and another pair of A Goldie, if you can't tell, it's like my favorite brand. I have some white shorts back here, some pull on shorts. Like I said, this is not everything, but they're just like my main go-tos. Here is a lot of my athletic wear sports bras and then I have some like biker shorts my leggings all that workout stuff and then down here is just kind of like a random like Spanx full leather leggings all that kind of stuff I do want to share about my office rug I love this rug so much I'll link it it's an Amazon prime rug it's pretty big as you can see so um, in the center here I have my office table I've had this for over a year now and I just love this so much I do all my work in here pretty much um, I just like first thing in the morning I get my coffee come right in here set my laptop down and begin working and I have like my little to-do list here and my phone stand you could just put your phone on top here if you wanted to and my little coaster and then these are the grace rose farm roses which i think look absolutely gorgeous like look at that I mean, so stunning this marble table is really nice quality it comes with the gold base um i'm gonna see if it's still available um if not there's so many similar ones so i'll link it these chairs i believe should still be available they're com very comfy and the quality has been great. As I said, I've had them for a year and they've held up amazing so far. And now um, over here, as I said, that's the walk-in closet door. I have some office supplies in here. I'll sometimes wheel the office supplies. It just wheels really easily over by my table if I need to. Sorry, the lighting is getting really weird. And this is where I always do my try and hauls. Um, so you guys know this mirror is from Bed Bath & Beyond. I don't know if I can find it online, but I got it in store a long time ago. Like when I was starting to do try and hauls. That's, I've had it for quite some time. So I definitely love it. And I have this little table here with the flowers. And if you guys, I always get questions on where these are from. This is the name of the online website, Venus at Floor. So definitely great. They last a year. They're like real roses, but they somehow get them to last a year. And we'll move along over here. As I said, this is not as like organized. This is all like newer stuff that I either just get in or some things I wanna show you guys. And I don't wanna forget because I have my clothing all dispersed throughout my apartment so I don't wanna like lose track of anything or forget. So this keeps me really organized. So I have this like rack here and this is like a lot of newer stuff, newer pieces and this like romper. I've showed this or if I know I just wanna show something again or just get multiple use out of it, I'll like put it here. A lot of this stuff was from a try on haul recently. So yeah, that's pretty much all on this rack. I also have another rack in my bedroom of like newer arrivals as well. And then I have this bag here. So these are some more newer like bags and shoes. And then I just got, sorry, the lighting is weird right here. My window's like a bunch of light is like flooding in right here. Um, but this is like something on wheels. So I'll just pull it out. That's why it's like put behind the mirror. But um, it's just like office supplies, more office supplies in here. I'll show you guys one of the drawers. Like this drawer on the side of the mirror. It has a bunch of just like organization, pens, random stuff. Some of them have like file, like this top one has file folders, so I'm not gonna share that one. So I think I've covered everything in my office. And if I miss anything, if you want me to give you any specific link to anything, definitely comment below and I'll show you guys my chandelier. 
So I felt like the chandelier like really completed the whole room. So that is it for my closet and office tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give this video a thumbs up and let me know what videos you want to see next, what requests you have for me. I'd love to chat with you guys more below. So that is me for today's video. You can check out all links in that description box below. And I will see you all in my next video very soon. Love you guys. Bye.